Okay, so I've taken all his tack off and he's just in a loose harness just around his neck. Uh, because for the next part um, I need tape, I need the muzzle and I actually need some scissors. So um, Kola is a really good escape artist and he'll often um, escape his muzzle using his friends here to help him. So to make sure he doesn't um, lose it I have to make a plait in his hair which you can see there. Then I wrap the plait in tape to make sure it doesn't come off. And I actually fit the muzzle through this hole and then I tape the whole whole thing up. Oh, and he doesn't really like it because obviously he likes to eat a lot. So he's, he's a good boy generally. He doesn't fight me. His ears have gone back to say, what are you doing? Um, there is a little hole there. So that's where he eats and drinks out of. So we're not cutting off his food supply entirely. This strap just goes round his ears and it's quite hard to do with one hand and just goes through the hole of the plant that I made. So let me just do that and then I'll reposition it so you can have a look and see. So it's not very neat as you can see, but the plait has stayed on. The strap's just gone through the plait. And now, now we will attempt to just to tighten that up like that. Now um, that won't be enough he will be able to take the velcro bit off because he's really really super clever so now what I've got to do with this tape is I've got to tape the plait and the velcro bit together so again I'm going to pause it do it and then show you 